Welcome to the second week of Five on Friday. Today, the theme is going to be mobility. So we're looking at restoring ranges of motion that we might have lost, sat down at our desks all day through lockdown. We've got five exercises for you. Each exercise is gonna be done for one minute. If it's a single side exercise, it's gonna be 30 seconds on each side. Okay, let's get into it. First exercise is gonna be called a couch stretch, okay? So we're looking to lengthen the front part of our uh, thigh here. We're going to take a chair, put our heel on the chair with our knee as close to the chair as possible. We're then going to tuck our hips up underneath and drive our hips forward in this position here. If we want to exacerbate the stretch, we're going to reach overhead and down. Make sure we breathe throughout. On this exercise, because it's single sided, we're going to go 30 seconds on each side. Second exercise is called a pec stretch, okay? Because we're hunched over our desks all day, we need to open that area back up. We can either do this two ways. First one is all fours on the floor. I'm gonna stretch out this hand as far as I can to the side and then turn my body away from that hand. Again, 30 seconds each side on this exercise and we're gonna make sure that we keep on breathing throughout. The second way of doing this exercise is to stand in a doorway, have our arm at 90 degrees, push into the door frame and turn our chest away. Okay, third up, we've got something called a thoracic cat cow. Okay, the thoracic is the part of our, our back that we, we're stretching here. We're gonna take all fours again. I want you to push the floor away and make an arch in the upper back as high as you can. Okay, we're gonna keep pushing those floor, that, the floor away. Your scapula should come around your ribs. We're then gonna sink and roll up our back like a newspaper, and then again, stretch, push the floor away, and drive the upper back as high as you can. Because this exercise is double-sided, we're gonna go for a minute, get through about 10, 15 reps of that. Okay, number four, we've got a 90-90 hip switch. We're gonna take a seat on the floor, and we're gonna start off with two 90 degree ang angles, one in the front leg and one in the back. To start with, I'm gonna lift off my back foot if I can. Don't worry if you can't. The intent to do it is, is all that we need. So we're gonna lift off here, and then I'm gonna sit forward and bridge the hips through. Then I sit back, lead with this back knee, turning over, switching into the other side. Lift off my back heel, and then sit up again. Okay, we're gonna do this continuous for one minute total. Make sure we've got control of, over each rep though, and we're not rushing any of the movements, okay? So one minute total on that one. Okay, last up on this week's Five on Friday, we've got the world's greatest stretch. It is called that because there's so many component parts, we're stretching out our entire body, okay? So keep up with this one. What we're gonna start is we're gonna take down into a press up position. I'm gonna take one leg and place it outside of my hand. If I can't get into this position, just drop the back knee to the floor. Okay, so drive your back knee straight if you can. We're then gonna take this inside hand, rotate through to the sky. I'm then gonna place it back outside my foot and try and straighten this front leg. Okay, that's one repetition. I'm gonna step back up and repeat on the other side. Press up position, foot outside hand, rotate, and then straight back up. One minute total. Okay, so there are our five exercises. To summarize, we've got a couch stretch, we've got our pec stretch done on the floor or in a doorway, we've got a thoracic cat cow where we're pressing into the floor, we've got a 90-90 hip switch, and lastly, the world's greatest stretch. Thanks for tuning in today, guys. Next up, we've got Mr. DeLuca with some overnight oats for you, a delicious idea for breakfast. This week, the sports department have decided for the Five on Friday to bring you five ingredients in under five minutes to make a healthy and nutritious breakfast. You may notice it's actually in the evening and that's because tonight we're doing overnight oats with these four ingredients here and we'll introduce the fifth one later. So what you need is one part oats, I've done half a cup here, to one part milk, half a cup of milk. I'm going to pour that into the oats. I've got a sweet tooth so I'm going to add a little teaspoon of honey. And then because I like the extra protein, 
I'm also going to add a scoop of nacho yogurt. And then the simple thing is I mix that up, make sure it's all covered. And if you have one of these handy little jars, nice and easy, I seal that and I put it in the fridge. If not, you can cover it with anything else um, and put it in the fridge overnight. And then that fifth ingredient, well, that's your toppings in the morning. So when that's done, you then can choose from anything you want in the toppings, from peanut butter to seeds and nuts, that fresh fruit, literally the world's your oyster. Enjoy, good luck, and let me tell you all about it.